Symptoms of asthma include shortness of breath, chest tightness or pain, coughing and or a wheezing or whistling sound when exhaling. To treat a patient who you suspect is suffering from an asthma attack, first ask them two important questions. Do they have asthma? And have they ever been to the intensive care unit because of it? If they are an asthmatic and they have a puffer, obtain the puffer and administer. Ventolin is very effective for exercise-induced asthma and an ambulance may not be required once this treatment has occurred. Next, sit the person down and ensure they are upright. The diaphragm works best in this position. When treating, follow the asthma first aid guidelines, four to six puffs for a cycle. Each time they breathe in a puff, get them to take four breaths. This is why a spacer is recommended. After giving the first cycle, monitor the patient and wait four minutes before proceeding with another cycle. It is very common for a patient suffering from asthma to cough because they have an irritant in their airways. When giving Ventolin, always use a spacer if there's one available. Asthma is a lower airway condition. The use of a spacer means less drug is required and more of the Ventolin is going down where it's needed. Repeat the first cycle and if they do not improve and or if they deteriorate, call triple zero and continue going through the cycles every four minutes.